looking for yes, a way to I keep the heat and stay cool in the summertime. <laughs> okay, good. Well, this is just for you. You can head to your local Malco Theater. Let's take a look at what's new in our Malco Movie Minute. Now, right. first up, one movie explores what happens if the greatest band in history never existed. Interesting premise. Well, a struggling musician <laughs> gets by with a little help from his friends. And yesterday, Hamish Patel plays a songwriter ready to uh, just put in a hard day's night. Yep. Just throw it all away. <laughs> but he gets uh, a world power, kind of helter-skelter kind of thing. So what happens is he gets, gets into this accident, and he wakes up and realizes that nobody has ever heard of the Beatles. Nobody knows the Beatles. So he kind of uses that to uh, his advantage. So yeah. looks really, really good. Does. Yesterday, rated PG. Yeah, I love it. Uh, I, and, and Danny Boyle, I think, directed this, and he yes. directed some monster hits. Uh -huh. So, I mean, I love this thing. Yeah. Uh, I love the premise. Even the trailers have got me hooked. Uh, here's another thing that's got me hooked kind of in a different way, though. Everybody <laughs> knows the evil is not contained in Annabelle Comes Home. Ooh. This continuation of the Conjuring universe finds Ed and Lorraine Warren encasing their deadly demon doll in their own home. Mm. But being on lockdown doesn't mean the murder puppet... <laughs> Love that phrase, the murder, murder puppet. puppet. Yes, <laughs> can't summon other evils, and the horrible horde sets its sights on the teenage babysitter Ooh. taking care of the Warrens' young daughter. Annabelle comes the home. The babysitter? Mm, yeah. It's always the babysitter. <laughs> I cannot wait to see this. Mm. It's rated R, so I'll probably be going alone. Jill doesn't really like scary movies either, so I, I you know, just gonna be me. I'll sitting probably there. be going alone, sleeping here at the station <laughs> at night. Yes, freak, freaked out. That's fine. Tell us how that is. I will. <laughs> Definitely will. Now, if you haven't seen The Avengers, there's still time to catch it in theaters. Listen, no judgment because I honestly just saw it about two weeks ago. I haven't seen it. So, so there's still Ooh. time to see it in theaters before a limited time only. You can watch the team do whatever it takes to save the universe. Of course, it is showing locally at the Pinnacle Hills Malco, and that is in Rogers. Marvel released a new version right. of the uh, movie, just like at the end. There's yeah. a tribute and I think a deleted scene but there is a catch on that. I would call the theater first to see if they're showing that particular that version? Oh. version or not because it's not clear on how many theaters are going to be showing that. So make sure you call in advance and say, hey, are you showing kind of this, this extra footage that Marvel released? So still got time to see it. I would probably say you probably have today. Yeah. It's going to be gone. I checked the movie app <laughs> and it was today. I would say get there, get there. if you want to see it. Get there now. <laughs> to watch it. Otherwise, you'll have to wait until, man, they roll out that the Disney DVD, streaming right? service yeah. Oh, yeah. on digital. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, for sure. Man. So make sure you check that out. And you know, it's they're kind of like, they want to go after, I don't want to say go after, but they would love to topple Avatar and be the most uh, highest grossing film of all time. So yeah, they're almost there. Number two. They're almost there. Yeah. That's right. 